Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Um, I know that we've been very consistently uploading our travel videos. Um, obviously I'm home right now, but I wanted to take a quick break from uploading those to update you guys on what the heck is going on with YouTube. Um, I've gotten, obviously you guys can tell if you're in this video or if you've been to any of our recent videos that our comments are disabled. There has been a lot going on. People have a lot of questions. And just to be like totally frank, I don't have all the answers. I'm gonna do my very best to tell you what I know and what the future looks like for us um, to the best of my ability and what our plans are and things like that. Um, but I can't, obviously I can't speak for YouTube and I don't know exactly what the future holds. So, so I just wanna say before I get started in this, no matter what happens, we're not just going to disappear, but I could, I don't know what's going to happen with this channel. So I have two quick suggestions. Number one, go follow me on Instagram. Sign up for our email newsletter. We have, we started that a long time ago and we just didn't do much with it. And now we've kind of figured out exactly what we want to do with it. So there's a link down below and every week you will get an email from us and we're not gonna bombard you or harass you or anything like that, but it'll be a really good place where you can keep up. We'll kind of post different things in there so you'll know if you've missed anything, and that is from now on going to be the first place that we make announcements or share anything, and we do have some really big things coming up this year, like the biggest thing since 2017. And so I don't want you guys to miss those things. I don't want to miss sharing them with you. And so our email newsletter subscribers are going to find out about all of those things first. Listed down below in the description box, be sure to sign up or follow and all of that place is there. And now let me get into kind of explaining what's going on. And all of the changes that they are making are supposed to be in the name of keeping kids safe, which you guys know I am all for. And that's the thing, I think that's what makes this so hard is that um, I'm completely behind making YouTube safe for kids or safer for kids. And I can't say that I think that the way that YouTube is going about this right now is um, the best way right now our comments are disabled and I've had a lot of people say well You know you can go in and turn them back on no we can't there are a handful of channels that I know who've had their comments permanently or indefinitely I should say removed YouTube has gone in and taken our comment section down and No longer gives us the ability to turn them back on and just hold for approval now that's very frustrating to us because if you've been a viewer of our channel for a long time, you know number one, uh, how important it is to us that we're very careful about what we post of our kids. We're not exploiting our kids. We're not putting our kids in danger. We're not, um, you know, we feel as though we are, are doing everything we can to um, play by the rules and also to not be disgusting people and keep our kids safe and have fun and do this, which is really amazing and keeping memories for our family and everything. Um, but in a safe way. We feel like we've always done a really good job at that. So it feels like kind of a slap in the face. Um, and to be honest, uh, we've also always moderated our comment section very heavily. In fact, we've taken crap for it from time to time from people saying like, oh, you delete comments. Yeah, we do, because we don't let nastiness, evil, things like that live in our comments. We just don't. And so we have done that for a really long time. And it's just kind of sad that um, because of a few people doing really bad things, certain channels are being punished and there's not a lot of rhyme or reason to it. I think that's where we struggle is that if you notice, there are a lot of family channels. In fact, I would argue that probably at least 80%, 90% of who I watch still have their comment sections and we don't. Um, YouTube has basically said that what they're doing is some, for some channels, they're removing your comments and throttling your videos. And basically what that means is that they are no longer they're kind of killing your videos like they're not suggesting them they're not putting them in browse and features things like that so um, you can probably tell our views have been cut in half or a third lately and it's because YouTube is no longer suggesting our content and I don't even I don't even have certainty that they're actually pushing it out to our subscribers either I don't know that everyone's getting notifications um, and I don't know that everyone's even seeing us in their subscription feed um, it's not like they have a process where we can say, oh, hey, wait, you've got it wrong. We're not, we're okay, our channel's okay, our content's okay, and they'll come look at it and fix it. There's no appeals process. So we just have to essentially wait it out. I guess wait until someone reviews our channel manually, or I, I mean, I don't know. And that's the hardest part is there's not a lot of um, 
There's not a lot of communication letting us know like if there's anything we should be doing differently or what, you know? But there's a lot of other little things. We've talked to a ton of different um, friends of ours who are also creators. And it's tough for them too though because it, you know, YouTube has also said that if we've allowed you to keep your comments, you better keep them on disabled anyways and you need to be really careful um, because they will remove people from the YouTube partner program. They will demonetize your channel like that. Like there's no strike system or anything. They'll just come in and do it. Um, so everyone is just kind of like on high alert right now. Um, I do believe that YouTube will get this figured out and hopefully sooner rather than later and that things will return to normal, that they will give creators back their comment sections um, and probably with stricter monitoring guidelines, which is totally fine by me. I've always said that I felt like it was nuts that on every other platform I'm on, there's there's no there's nowhere close to the kind of weirdness and craziness that you see in the comments of YouTube videos. YouTube is its own world in that sense. I think it's probably going to end up being long term for the better um, because it's going to stop those kind of predatory comments. And I think it's also I really hope that they devise a system to hold people accountable um, for their comments and things that they say and leave on videos. And I'm just glad to see that YouTube is going to be doing something about that. I just I completely understand why YouTube is doing this. I completely understand. I do think that there's a better way than what they've chosen, um, but nobody asked me. So <laughs> shocking. No one asked me what I thought. Um, so we're just going to try to ride out this wave, but like I said, I definitely want to encourage you guys because I don't know and because YouTube has said that there is no strike system. So if they decide that there's something that they see they don't like, and a lot of times it's stuff they're filtering through old comments on your channel and if they find something, they, they could just delete your whole channel. They could remove your AdSense. They can or your like your monetization on your videos. You could lose your whole channel altogether. You could no longer be allowed to be part of the YouTube partner program. All of these things that they're saying could absolutely happen and there's no like, oh, you shouldn't do that, don't do that, or we're gonna, it's just like, nope, done, guillotine. <laughs> Practically speaking, we are also going to be, for every video that we upload here on The Scattered Nest, I'm gonna be including a link in the description to an Instagram post that will correspond so you guys can leave your comments there. And then Ciara and I can be on there responding to you guys and everything um, on the comments on the Instagram post. Figure that'll be a way that we can still interact about the video um, without actually doing it here on YouTube. And we're also gonna post a picture of the thumbnail on our community tab. And we can, um, I think we should have permission, we can. I think we can still use our community tab. So I'm gonna post a picture of the thumbnail there and then we can also talk there in the comments about the video. So I'm trying to make ways for us to still communicate because it's so incredibly important to me that I be able to hear you guys and like I don't wanna feel like I'm just putting these videos out into a void and I don't, I feel like I know you guys, you know, there's so many of you that instantly when you comment I recognize your name and, and so it makes me sad to think that I won't hear from you for a while until this gets fixed. So those are gonna be the places where you can comment um, and the other places, like I said, where you can follow. Like I said, I wish that I had more definitive answers uh, and there's other things I've heard and stuff, like, but I don't wanna put rumors out there. So I'm just stating sort of what we've been told by YouTube directly and a little bit of like back end chatter from other creators about the future of this and that kind of thing. So I don't wanna to speculate too much. Um, but I do think that um, this is definitely something to take very, very seriously. Uh, but I also believe that YouTube is going to, I have faith in them, that they are going to get this fixed and get people's comments back and we will be back to normal, hopefully sooner rather than later. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for always being here and so supportive and loving to our family. We'll see you guys on Thursday for our next video. Next video is gonna be a really good one a really good one. So that's the other thing too is come back and check. We upload Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and I might upload an extra video in there, but usually it's Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. So come back and check if you haven't seen our videos. Um, we upload those days, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday at 8 a.m. Eastern time. So that's always our upload schedule, um, especially time and stuff like that. So that's it guys. I'm going to stop talking now. Hopefully I answered as much as I could your questions and I'll see you guys again in just a couple days. Bye.